Hi guys. Today I'm going to teach you how to print the screen, the iOS like this. If I'm going to run this application, it's a basic sprite kit application. So what what I'm going to teach you is when I am going to press something on the screen it will sprint the screen okay oh. mm. make sure that's where I printed no this is a simple application okay those are the screen that been printed and those are pictures that have been printed at the screen. So inside. First you need to do is to create a new application. Go to file. I know it's go to file. Uh, project it's shift command M start a new lamps spike kit spike kit game this is a spike kit application so you click this then next give it a name then ju just next 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 and the the base set but I'm but I already have an open application which I will cancel. So when you start the spike kit application you will see this file. Okay. So to enable that if you don't see this file click this one. Okay. So you will you need to go to your my sim that m Okay, so the first thing you see is this. Most of these are not really a part of the tutorial because it's already been written for us by the Sprite engine. So, how do I, what will I, what will I go into do? Move for those uh, screenshot from, from Spike it. Well, first we need to create a function. So, first you will create UI image, then call that snapshot or whatever you want. It. Second, UI graphics begin. You only want to make sure that the image context within options. So next, set the boundaries and what you want your program, uh, your you want to print and compare it with the image. So this is self view bound set size, giving dividing the size, then screen. Next. Uh, self view drawer hierarchy in your self view that down after screen update. Yes, next, yeah, image snapshot. Uh, this is important. This is important because this is what we're going to do when we wanted to. The export the image to an album, which is happen in this part. It will save from the album. Okay, but first you need to end the UI graphics because we begin it, right? You need to end it. The or you will have an error if you want. Well, I'll show it to you. Okay. Square. 
It's, it, it's good, it's working. Next slide. Okay. Yes, you, you can start. And it's optional okay for you to then back just to make the play it safe, uh, UVs and the UI graphics, right? So then we are going to save it to the to the final album second the, the last part is to return to return because this is a UI yeah, image so it's a uh, return type cannot be saved nothing if you if you're going to put it that way you see it's a tail. It's, it's a command point function. You need a return type. Okay. And uh, if you are really going to ask me, what is this part? Well, this part right here is what you need when you are going to send this to, let's say, you'll go, you I'm going to post it on um, uh, Facebook. You will go, you want to post on the Facebook or Twitter, which I'm going to teach you later. If you uh, if you're going to have to write it. <laughs> so this is a simple tutorial on how to print a screen. To simple tutorial. I'm going to run it. Okay. It's working. It's working. No. It's working out right. Right. Okay. Thanks, guys.